Now, on to the comparisons to Luminous and constructive feedback on Canvas. Oh boy, there's so many things to note. The dashboard should really be more populated with information. It's a dashboard for a reason. You enter the site, and that's the first thing you see. So you really want to see as many things as possible in one glance. Do away with the module images since most modules won't use them. Hell, just throw modules into their own tab instead of taking up space on the dashboard. Add announcements so that you can see them at a glance. Maybe a weekly schedule to see all your lectures, tutorials, and labs. And put student feedback here so that you don't have to toggle between all the different modules just to do them one by one. The to-do list gets to stay. The courses tab should be renamed to avoid confusion. Causes in NUS mainly refer to one's major. It should be changed to modules. Unless Canvas doesn't allow that renaming to happen, then that's just bad design. Also, having to click multiple times way more than necessary just to access certain features is really annoying. Either you show more or don't show it at all. The calendar, like I've already complained about before, could be synced with the lessons you are having. Currently, it seems like professors would have to type in every single lecture and tutorial for it to be reflected in the calendar. That is not ideal since professors already have a lot of things on their plates, and trying to free up more time for them would be the best cost of action. The ideal scenario would be to link the calendar up with edurec since edurec already has a list of all the modules that we're having and also whichever time slot that we are choosing the tutorials on. Of course, this is me saying it with absolutely no idea what's going on behind on IT security, uh, backend development, all that sort of stuff, and I have no idea how much of a nightmare this is going to take when trying to implement it. Of course, there's still a lot more to talk about for the calendar. First off, the weekly schedule. Ideally, there should be a horizontal vertical alignment toggle for both mobile and PC optimization. Again, with the weekly schedule, it should be the default option instead of the monthly calendar. Students would need to know more about their immediate and short-term deadlines, more so than the project work that is going to be submitted two months down the line. Moving on to another feature, the inbox. This is redundant. We already have Outlook. There's no need to further complicate things by having another avenue for communication. History is also another redundant feature. Just by making accessing information in the modules easier, you can just remove this. This would not even need to be a thing. Studio. Please just don't let this become a genius world tab. The accounts tab with the settings is also another thing that needs a lot of change. First off, remove the false tab. Each tab should have clear-cut functions and having global navigation alongside of your account settings is just plain confusing and generally in the wrong place. Also, with how Canvas is making the navigation of files look like going through a folder browser, having a global navigation and having to search for specific files deep within the system would be very, very tedious and not a good experience. So just remove it. Another thing to remove would be global announcements that could go to the dashboard. Also, another thing to remove would be students feedback. You can just shift it to the dashboard. Another thing, if the student feedback reports are for teachers only, then just remove it for the student version. We don't need to see it. Now, on to the final and major problem, the course menus. When you have something that has to be accessed several times every single day by the entire student population, having bad design is a big red flag. Modules in a module. It should ideally be changed to something like lessons, but I'm assuming that this is the case of not being able to change names in Canvas. The loading time in Canvas is comparable to Luminous, but somehow the people in Groups tab load way faster than Luminous. Chat should be removed. It would either be chaotic from everyone spamming in the group or underutilized only showing notifications from announcements, which announcements is more than enough to do so. There is another means of communication here in the module itself. It's called discussions. The forum strat is more than enough as a means of communication between students and staff. So we can just remove chat. It would make no difference. Grades and analytics could be combined into a single tab since both are very similar in purpose. Also, the ability to know how many times I went to a specific page or the number of emails I sent to my professors and other students, there's not that much use for this kind of information. Syllabus could be addressed in the homepage, so I don't see a purpose for it to be in a standalone tab. Currently, I can see it being implemented in a weird way as a way to show assignment deadlines, but that's not the syllabus, is it? Same can be said for readings, which could just be shown in the modules or home tab. Student feedback would be very underutilized, except for the two occasions of midterm feedback from module coordinators or the feedback exercise at the end of every semester. So that could just go to the homepage instead for the ease of use for students. Instead of having our students go to every single module just to finish one or two forms, having it in a centralized location would make it easier for us and generally would incentivize the answering of feedback forms. If you're going to make it difficult, we're not going to do it. Files. It's plain obvious that Canvas is a glorified folder browser. And this is a huge downgrade from Luminous in terms of readability and ease of use. If there's a way to improve the UI to make it closer to that of Luminous and make it look nicer, 
that would really greatly improve on the user friendliness. Pages is also in a similar situation. The readability is bad, but not as bad as files. And the bits and pieces of information could be shifted elsewhere with better presentation. There is functional overlap with the file step plus a little bit more. If there is a better way of doing it, like for example, putting more information on the home tab, that would be ideal. LAJ2202 Japanese Tree is a good example of good design. In its homepage, there is everything that you ever need to know about the module from the module details to lesson materials to course readings and everything else. So it is a very good example of how things can be done right and other modules could follow suit. You know what, there's just so many glaring issues that I've made a mock-up so that you can see the side-by-side -side comparisons between what it currently is and what it could be. Personally, I felt that Luminous was rather polished. Although there are still things that could be improved upon, it has really come a long way since its inception two years ago. Changing to a third-party vendor like Canvas when our own in-house LMS is just starting out feels to me that NUS is wanting to cut down on costs for maintaining server infrastructure and website upkeep. But whatever the reason may be, at least make it such that it does not disrupt everyday operations of students and educators. Because currently, the new LMS is really very rough very unpolished, with a crazy amount of redundancy and bloat. So, please fix this.